even here I'm going to drop a clip so you can see how here used to look like a donkey track so things are happening in St. Thomas hurt are being removed things are happening those massive rebars running along look at that look at the line of work guys this is very good you can see the men working traffic is on one side you can see the men setting up their line to continue the next stretch of this roadway yeah that this is really impressive i can imagine when the rest of the road is completed this is the quality we'll get redevelopment as we cruise through Church Street Morant Bay heading towards the roundabout and we are going to give you the latest on Red Hill Spend the progress that they have made since the last time we traveled this section and I had referred to it as donkey truck because of the conditions that was because of the conditions that existed in that location nonetheless um, I am going to show you the progress as we progress through Church Corner Marant Bay and it's a sunny day bright beautiful weekend and this video won't be long but remember to smash that subscribe button and leave your comment in the comment section of the progress what you think I can see that flow engineers are out today doing some underground work and looking pretty good um, hope that improves the connectivity within the parish as mobile users tend to be paying roughly 3,000 plus per month without getting value for money because the network is poor. Anyway, with that said, you can see a build up of traffic in this location. Recently, they, they had paved this section of the road, but they came back and laid some pipe and also there are sections where the water dig up the road and all of that stuff so traffic is basically at a crawl these days but most importantly i want to say thanks to everyone who have subscribed who have left a comment and who have supported the growth and the development of the channel I want to say a special thank you because all of that means a lot so as we progress towards Red Hills Bend going through a section of Cottage Bend we are now entering the Mark Bay roundabout and we are going to progress towards that location at this time so here we are and we are back a nice smooth asphalt looking very good pristine 
one can say so we are going to see how long that this section of the road will last it's in a very good condition this is with the exception of the section that's been done by check from Yalas to Arborview this is probably the best piece of road available in St. Thomas and the last time we had ended the video somewhere here based on the work that they were doing as you can see that the drains are completed you can see that portions of the road is properly asphalt and yeah the road is looking smooth so this section runs from Mark Bay roundabout to Cedar Valley and it's looking quite impressive wherever it ends that's where we will have a turn around or terminate the video and even here I'm going to drop a clip so you can see how here used to look like a donkey truck the men are putting in some hard work to make sure that this section of the road looks really 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 good as I can see the whole drain that has been excavated oh mega drains been put in place to accommodate water as you know climate change is real so you can't use them small tiny drains anymore you have to use big drains like this yes guys as you can see this is the red hill spin road in st thomas look at what is happening look at those fat steel that they are using to widen expand and to ensure those massive rebars running along look at that look at the line of work guys this is very good you can see the men working traffic is on one side you can see the men setting up their line to continue the next stretch of this roadway the men are working away guys look at that the excavating working very close to the pipe but professionally it's not touching so things are happening in St. Thomas hurt are being removed things are happening you can see guys man digging away and of course this is Red Hill Spen Mark there, close to Park Over High School. It's now looking pristine, freshly built wall. So I think that's very good. Yep, and this is where it ends for today. We are going to we can see that they have done some curb wall work but not much signs of uh, sidewalks so it's concerning for those students who go to school in this location so i'll turn around the video here so that's where this piece of work has reached thus far since the last time we were here and uh, even though they don't asphalt this little piece right where Van Der Pan now um, it is drivable and uh, looking good so let me see how much minutes it will take from here to get to the roundabout and I am cruising at about 40 kilometers and not bad not bad at all uh, okay, so we officially cruise through cottage bed and we are heading to 
towards round about Mark Bay. And yeah, that, this is really impressive. I can imagine when the rest of the road is completed, this is the quality we we'll get. Anyway, have a wonderful weekend. Blessings to you and your family. Keep safe and thank you very much for your continued support. Yes.